Hello everyone, it is Claudia here and today I am back with another process video using the Citrus Twist May Kits. Uh, actually, I'm only using the main kit, so kits is not really relevant for this um, particular video. And this is the second time I'm doing the voiceover because I listened back to the audio and it was really low. And uh, I know sometimes the audio on my videos um, is kind of low. Uh, and usually to me it's still fine, but um, on the voiceover I just did, it was really low, so I felt like I didn't want to upload it that way. Um, so yeah, this is my second attempt at doing a voiceover, and hopefully this one will be okay, and if not, you guys will never get to hear it. Um, but what I'm doing now is I'm just um, outlining these letters that spell Live More, and this is a paper that comes in a main kit, and it's from the Pink Fresh Studio Live More collection, and what I like about this paper is that it's pretty much a template for a layout, or at least that's how I look at this paper. And uh, when I got the kit, I felt like it would make for a really nice background, so that's what I'm doing, and I've been trying to kind of challenge myself to use um, more patterned papers as my background instead of uh, white cardstock because that's what I've been using for the past few months and if you look at my older videos from 2015 when I just started doing videos then um, you will see that um, a lot of the layouts I made back then had patterned papers as a background and I don't really know when I stopped doing that or why I stopped doing that but I definitely want to use patterned paper as a background more often and right now I'm just going to work a little bit on my layering. I'm not going to do too many layers behind my photo um, just because I felt like I didn't need it. And uh, the photo I'm scrapping is a photo of my cat Joey and this photo was taken recently. I don't really remember when. I think it was taken in March and I should probably start putting dates somewhere on my layout so I can remember later on because obviously a few years from now I may not remember uh, when this photo was taken and um, I got it printed in black and white because yeah because I really just love black and white photos and I feel like I'm seeing this in every um, video and I had to start the voiceover so I apologize if I'm repeating myself um, it's been a bit of a frustrating day for me, or at least a day um, where I'm doing this voiceover, um, but um, yeah. So I really like the twine, I think it's twine, that the uh, kids come in, and uh, the colors of the twine always match the colors that are in the kit, so you can, you know, use them in different ways, and I just thought it would be nice to just, you know, put them on the layout. Um, like I just did and if I could stitch I probably would have stitched but I can't and I definitely want to learn how to I think it looks amazing on all the projects that everybody is using stitching on I just haven't really gotten around to really um, get into it but hopefully in the future I can um, you know get into it and learn how to properly do it so um, off camera I did add a few things. I added a um, strip of pattern paper at the top and that paper came in last month's April kit um, and I did that off camera because I wasn't planning on doing that originally but then um, I just thought that it would look nice so that's why I did that. But um, as always you will see that in close-ups that are in the end of the or at the end of the video so um, hopefully it doesn't uh, bother you too much and I really love the paper clip uh, that came in the kit you get too and I think it's like a split pack so um, you know if you're a subscriber or if you're getting the kit yours might be different from mine but I felt like the one that I used for this layout really matched my color scheme perfectly and um, after that I decide, decided to punch out some one inch uh, circles with my circle punch which I really love and adore and should probably use more often and I don't think you see what I'm going to do with them um, in this video, but you will see that in the close-ups as well. Um, I think I didn't record it because I didn't really know what I was going to do with them, so I just decided to leave it and uh, think about it off, 
camera because I didn't want to take a really long time recording uh, videos because of my phone overheating even though it shouldn't really overheat because it's well actually it's not a new phone it's a refurbished phone um, but yeah I don't want to take any risks with my phone and I think we're getting pretty close to the end of the video right now so thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed it Make sure to check out the Citrus Twist Kits if you haven't done so already and hopefully I'll be back with more videos soon. Have a great day!